All right, so I'm about to go try these gowns on. I almost wish that I did not post a picture of the other dress last night because so many of you messaged me and said, MB, if you do not wear that dress. And like, when I tell you I'm obsessed with it, I think y'all know I'm obsessed with it. But I also never, like I want, I have an excuse to wear a long formal gown. And I, I just wanna wear a long gown. I feel like the I feel like the one that I have is more like party. You know what I mean? I want to feel like I'm going. To, I want to feel like I'm going to the prom. So I'm gonna go try these on. I'll share some of them. I mean, I'll share the stuff I try on. I don't even know if I'm at the right place to be honest. So let me figure this out. I think we all know how much I'm obsessed with sequins and glitter. I just bought a dress that does not have a singular piece of glitter on it and I'm so shocked that I even bought like it's not even a dress that I would have picked off the rack the ladies working there who were first of all the sweetest ever um I went to hip chicks formal wear in there in Clemens they were all so sweet it made me feel so good because I was honestly like a little embarrassed <laughs> not embarrassed but I they knew what I was shopping for after I, t I, I don't know anyway they were so sweet to me and they pulled that dress because I told them I wanted either red or pink and it's stunning. They were all so sweet and made, like, made me, they were like gassing me up. They made me feel really good. Um, and I'm so excited about this dress, but I told them, I was like, okay, they knew I wanted sparkles. I made it very clear that I wanted sparkles and I, <laughs> I just could not, I tried this dress on the day. If you guys are locals, or if you're looking for a formal gown, prom, prom dresses, they also have like destination bridal gowns. They do tux rentals. Check them out. They The selection, I was overwhelmed, um, picked out for me and I couldn't get out of my head. And I was like, I'm buying it. And I was like, I can always do like a dress change. You know how brides do like, like I'm really somebody important. Like I'm gonna put on said that I was going to take pictures, but I also didn't want to, like, they were all helping me and I didn't want to be like standing there in the mirror, taking mirror selfies, which I don't think they would have minded, but you get the idea. You get what I'm saying? Like I'm going to do two gowns at the, I, y'all think I won't? It is, it's so basic, but still like so elegant. I feel like a Disney princess. I'm trying to show y'all the back, but that bottom piece is twisted because I need help. But, and I should probably get it hemmed. They gave me their or a card to their seamstress. But I, I love, uh, it's, and with the earrings. <laughs> I fell asleep watching the third episode of Sex in the City and I just woke up and I feel a little bit like pukey i'm a little bit nauseous and i know at least 10 of you are going to ask me if i'm pregnant and the answer is no and i don't know why y'all do that anyway i don't know why y'all ask people if they're pregnant just because they got a stomach ache because literally it could be 10 million other things anyway i have to announce my pick for giving with mb account that has just blown me away this month so she has tagged me or she has used the hashtag follower has used hashtag given with mb for the past like two months but she has stepped up her game in december and every time i see it because like i follow the hashtag and it come the pictures come up in my news feed and every time i see one of her pics they are so simple like her pictures are simple and she does a lot of like what are they called vignettes vignettes i don't know how to pronounce that word everything's like moody though photos or her, her feed her aesthetic is moody but it's like simple but like it's like warm she lives in canada they've already had snow and i think that's another reason like her i'm gonna share i'm gonna share some of her pics i don't understand why she doesn't have a bigger following this woman needs and deserves more followers sherry be living she has a dog named max i'm gonna share a picture of max too but please do me a huge give my girl a follow like her pics show her some of and tell her that MB sent ya.
my pick for given with mb i was scrolling and her picture was it was a scroll stopper i was like okay and then i went to her account and i was like her house like if i was a house if i was a house i'd be her house one thing about me that all of my friends and family know is I do not share food. Do not touch my food. Don't touch my food. I have to really love you. Which is why I gave Luke some rice.